Welcome back. Today we're going to quickly non-review review the Blonde Z200. So for those of you who forgot, the Z200 is uh, supposed to be reminiscent of the Blonde BL03 in a different shell with a nice moon pattern and a non-removable -remo cable. So it looks like it's removable, but it is not. And don't pull on it. The cable itself looks like an old KZ cable. Uh, it actually tangles super easy. So um, if you look at it, it will tangle, and I'm not going to touch it again. Otherwise, I will never untangle it. Packaging, uh, no more music and dryams. They actually fixed the grammar, which is a shame. They should go back to the original misspelling, as people enjoyed that very much. So on the graph, uh, very much uh, in line, kind of very similar to the O3. The same style uh, of sound, heavy bass, heavy mid-bass. Straight into your mids, lots of bleed, lots of kind of thicker, fuller notes. That's what you get on a blonde sound. And they try to kind of bump up the clarity and the detail a little bit. And uh, I'm not sure that all worked out as well as they had planned, but that is what they did on the graph. So let's quickly walk through uh, what this thing sounds like. So I think the good news is it sounds blonde BL03-ish. You know, I think it's... Uh, sort of there uh, in a way it sort of is there but the bad news is it really sounds a lot smaller and more recessed and i think the change to the shell they probably should have changed the tuning more to adjust to this shell or the angle there's something wrong with what they did here um, it's nice that they came to save some costs and made it non-removable but it really affected how this one sounds and maybe they started out with a very similar driver but the way it's sitting in that shell and the way it comes on your ear is uh, not not so good so the bad news too it's really hard to find a reason to choose this one uh, over bl03 and that's probably a mistake but uh, ignore that so the fit isn't really uh, an obvious win either and i think that was would have been an obvious win if this actually fit better than 03 but it doesn't for me i think I think 03 actually fits a little better for me. At least going A being them back and forth, it was actually easier to get uh, a fit on 03 than it was at this one. There's something shallow about it, and the angle, the angle maybe is a little strange. There's, uh, I don't know. It didn't really fit my ear all that well, so it wasn't an obvious win for me just on fit. Sound, it sounds like a smaller, more recessed, more congested BL03. So again, uh, I'm not. Not sure why you would choose the 200 uh, on this one. It it kind of sounds like a uh, inferior 03 stage. Pretty much all lost on Z200. It's uh, very small and not high. All that great stage from 03, pretty much all gone on Z200. So years later, I think BL03 is still a great set and worth the additional five dollars. So uh, skip this one and just pick yourself up an 03 and uh, maybe get yourself a new cable or some tips, but uh, that is a vastly better set than the Z200. So that's what I got on the Z200. So thanks again for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.